Okay, just give me your name and uh, position for the record, please. My name is Alfonso Aurelia. Mm -hmm. Alf Alfonso, uh, just give me an idea of what exactly it is that you're doing here and um, how this uh, whole presentation came about. Oh, basically, um, five years ago, um, we did this exact presentation to one of the uh, local schools in Granvia. I'm personally, I'm from the area myself, um, so these kids here probably wouldn't realize that. And um, uh, a few years ago when we came down, my son came and he had all his uh, nice brand new football boots and he was playing with the local kids and realized that the kids that we were playing with didn't have any um, proper footwear. And at the end of the vacation, he said to me, is it okay for me to give um, this particular boy my, my pair of boots and chill pad? I said, sure, go ahead. And the idea came about this, this idea came about in this kind of particular way. Mm -hmm. And that's why we, we decided every year when we come down, and that was five years ago, and this year we did the exact same thing. So we decided to come down with a lot of football boots to the donation and to hand up to the little club. It's one of the situations when you do certain things, you say to yourself, how, how is it going to be um, accepted? Is it going to be thrown upon or are people going to embrace the, the situation? is one of the situations you have to kind of like weigh it out to get how, how, how to do it. And my son said to me, listen, this is do it. And if they like it, they like it. If they don't, we'll just give it away to some or any charity that wants it, basically. And, uh, and we buy the bullet and we decided to do it. And we just brought the stuff down, really. Is this, the, is this the kind of thing you think that um, uh, you'd like to see? I mean, having spoken with the, the coaches who are part of this camp, um, is this the kind of thing you think that has been really embraced? And uh, do you, is this the sort of thing you think that more people could be doing um, just to be giving back to the communities where they came from? Well, I think it's a great idea. I mean, to be honest with you, it's kind of heartbreaking, to be honest with you, when I see what the local coaches here are doing with those kids with very little resources. And if I could help in any shape or shape or form, and if that's my way of contributing to the community, I'm very happy, I'm excited that I could do that, especially I have two young boys myself who plays football, and uh, to, to, for them to see what their father is doing for the community, that way it teaches them a, 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 a lesson in life as well, um, to show to give to, to wherever, wherever you're from, to the community as well. Um, I, think it's, I, I think it is outstanding, personally, what, what the local coaches are doing here with the, the minimal resources that they have. I think it's outstanding. And for me to be part of it in, in a little way, in shape or form, uh, I'm very happy to do so. Um, I'm looking forward to, to work with those guys in the future as well. This is not the end of it. I'm going to go back and I'll come back even do more stuff, even bigger, hopefully. Um, I really, really want to help because I think Solution on the whole have a lot of talent and I think the people in Sanusha or the, the, the politicians, they need to realize that and wake up. Those kids in this room right now, here right now, need an opportunity in life. They need a goal in life and it's by football, by cricket, by tennis, whatever sports they decide to, to play or to embrace. I think we need to give them this opportunity. We really do need that. And, and people need to start listening to those youngsters in this room right now. And you guys in there really need to understand how important it is to be involved in the local community and what you do, what those guys here are doing for you. They're doing it for your benefit because they want a better future for you. And it's so important that you guys embrace that. It, it's, it can bring tears to my eyes sometimes when I talk about it because this is one of the situations um, that I'm very passionate about because I'm a solution just like any one of you in, in this room. The only difference is, I just live abroad. Doesn't mean that I'm any different to you, doesn't mean I'm better than you. I'm just in a situation right now where I could do, give something back. And that's exactly what I'm doing. And if you think about it, every little, every solution that live abroad do, do what I'm doing. Each and one of you right in this room right now will have an opportunity to do something or even better. And some other, somebody else, when you become great at something, will rip your reward. You build the platform, you build the confidence of everybody in this room. So you see, it's in your benefit to do really, really well when you whatever sports that you decide to take on.